In this tutorial video, I'll explain the procedure to create such a two-dimensional figure using AutoCAD software. When you look at this figure, you can see that it's made up of six objects. We have four circles and two arcs. So let's start with creating these two circles. And after creating these circles, we'll take a copy of the circle into this location because these two circles are identical. So let's start with the circle command and I'll use center diameter method because the diameter of the inner as well as the outer circle is given. So I'll click to define the center and the diameter of the inner circle is given as 0.75. So I'll give 0.75. The circle is not properly visible because the limit is not set. Don't worry, all you have to do is just double tap the scroll wheel of the mouse to force a zoom extends. Then you zoom out to get a proper magnification for the circle. Next I'll construct the outer circle so I'll go to center diameter once more and choose the same center point when I'm asked to give the diameter it is given as 1.5 and I'll zoom out a bit next I'll take a copy of these two circles and I'll keep it in this location and you know that the center point of this circle is at a horizontal distance of 1.5 units rightward and vertical distance of 2.5 units downward with respect to this so I'm going to make use of relative coordinate entry method to define this point. Please refer my video on the various methods to plot points using AutoCAD if you are not familiar with relative coordinate method. I have provided the link in the upper right corner of this video. Now I'll give copy command and I'll select these two circles. This is the base point. When I master give the second point, I'll give at the rate 1.5 comma minus 2.5. I give minus for the y because it is in the negative y direction. Now I've got a copy of it, just give enter to go out to the copy command. Next I'll give fillet command to construct this particular arc. So I'll go to fillet, go to radius option, then give a radius of 3.5. And this is the first object and this is the second object. You have got a proper filleted arc. Next I'll repeat the fillet command to construct this outer arc. So and I'll give a radius of 6.5. There's a first object and the second object. You can see that you have got the arc in the opposite direction. So wherever the fillet fails, you can try the TTR circle. So I'll erase this arc. Then I'll go to circle command, tangent, tangent, radius or TTR option. When I'm asked to select a point on the object for the first tangent, I'll pick over here. And a point on the object for the second tangent, I'll pick over here. When I'm asked to give the radius, it is 6.5. So I'll give it a 6.5. Now you've got a big circle. You can just trim off the unwanted portion of the circle to create this arc. So I'll go to trim command, just give an enter. When I'm asked to select the cutting edges, now just click over here to trim off the unwanted portion. And this is how you complete this figure. Hope the simple tutorial in two dimension has given you some insights in completing such a 2D figure. Thanks for your time. Hope to see you in the next tutorial.